All right, close your eyes and take a trip to the ocean. Doc Local will take you there with their top-notch seafood and lobster rolls. That's right, you can find them in Assembly Food Hall. Brett and Rob are here, and folks, this looks fantastic. I wish you could smell this. Now, how did you all get started? Oh, fantastic question. We got started with a food truck, actually, in Dallas-Fort Worth area. Um, we just was, went crazy over there for a couple years, just on a part-time basis, and then uh, we bloomed up into about four stores in that area. And we have one here originally, uh, first to come to Nashville, actually. Oh, yeah. So happy. Phenomenal. So exciting. Okay, <laughs> Rob has already gotten started. If you didn't notice, he dropped in the lobster, and he's moving along as we chit-chat. Now, Brett, mm -hmm. I know you know your seafood. You're an East Coast guy. Yeah, straight from Maryland. I uh, grew up in the Washington, D.C. area. Just love that whole environment, uh, being off the Chesapeake Bay. <laughs> yeah. We had crabs every weekend. It was phenomenal. Look, there's one of my boat pictures. Uh, so we, uh, we, we, we just went bananas with that. And then uh, my cousin has lived in Boston or off the Cape Cod, so we had to bring in lobster. Lobster is the treat, right? It's the oh, very much special treat. Oh, so, yeah. Oh, yes, yeah. yes, yes, indeed. Now, do you do your lobster rolls with mayo or with butter? Because usually there's two different ways of making it. Yes, yes. Today we're doing it with mayo, but uh, we... I like them both. I like them both, but you know, there's a whole debate on the East Coast with Connecticut right. versus Maine. We all they all want to fight with each other. Exactly. Okay, <laughs> I have a question about that. So. Now that you're here in the South, do you get any special requests like Duke's Mayo? I mean, do the people actually ask you what mayo you're using? That, that, yeah. Do I they think, get that specific? I think, I think there's a personal preference. Yeah. yeah. You do? There's we do get, th get that question. Um, here at Doc Local, we like to use uh, Hellman's. <laughs> so that's our preference. Um, <laughs> right, right, right. There's and, always uh, a big debate about mayo. There is. <laughs> it is. It is. It is. It is. Very so, much so. So talk to me about where exactly do you source your seafood from? Mm. All right, so the Maine, the lobster's coming straight from Maine, a little town called Portland, mm -hmm. and then uh, also Bar Harbor as well. So that's coming from Maine. Uh, some of our other products are domestic, uh, like off the Cajun coast. Uh, we do a little bit there, but also they're also sourced out of the Pacific. So we do a Pacific cod that comes from straight from uh, right out of, out of Alaska or Russian territory, that type of thing. So yeah. Okay. So, so, so we're sourcing all over the country. All over the country. Yes, Love that. Yes, Love yes. Portland, Maine, by yep, the way. Yep, Two. Yep. Question for first-time customers. What would you recommend them Ooh. ordering? Ooh, if we could dial into this guy right here, this lobster, sriracha lobster, Yum. grilled cheese. Oh my gosh. Is just this to is die for. Nobody phenomenal. does it. We're the first to come with it. Uh, I think you're going to fall in love. It's just got a little bit of heat, a little bit of essence of lobster, lobster a lot of cheese. cheese. You think cheese and lobster don't go together? Completely wrong. They go, they go together. <laughs> okay. Lobster and then lobster what do we have over here? Uh, that is our lobster mac and cheese. Oh my, so we have yes. like lobster on our menu, like stiff six different locations, I mean six different items to choose from, plus other classics like fish and chips, and then we do a seafood boil as well. That's phenomenal. Oh, you do the Cajun. Cajun. You're going to need two yep. hands. Yep. Yep. You're going to need two hands. Yeah. Look, look at this. Look at this. <laughs> and look at this. I just want to show off these king lobster rolls. Rob, you've done it again. Yes, I yes. could eat this whole plate, ladies and gentlemen, exactly. and I would not be ashamed. Yes. Um, okay, so, so my friends. Go yes. ahead. No, Sylvia. So my, my question. question, we were we were literally having this conversation. People, yeah. Some people in the South have never had this. So what is it like for you all? to literally hand them their first lobster roll and see the look on their face. Talk to me about that, yeah, well, you that get, experience. You get it every day. Well, uh, <laughs> yeah, you know, you hand it over and you stuff the, that bun with mm -hmm. all that lobster meat, depending on if they get the Connecticut or the Maine or a grinder, and they're just always amazed and they just, they love the product, they love to see all the lobster, they love to uh, see all the, all the sides. My friends, <laughs> this is so fresh. I have not had seafood like this in Nashville. This mm -hmm. is to die for. The lobster right. is so light. I'm going to pass this over Thank because you. I'm not going to eat yes, it all myself. Gotta, yeah. I won't do I, that to you. I was sad thinking you were going to eat all these you by got yourself. It. I would never do that to you, Sylvia. <laughs> Well, honestly, oh, yes. guys, lemon. thank Gotta you do the lemon. so much. Absolutely. Yep. Absolutely. I don't know if we uh, plugged. Uh, we're in Assembly Food Hall. So exactly. Assembly Food Hall is great entertainment, great place to uh, dine, basically take in a show, right. take in some activities, and then the food is phenomenal. We're not the only one there. So, so we do have like 20 offerings. Exactly. <laughs> exactly. Go before your concert, go yep. before the game, and get a second look. Check out their full menu online or just so head good. to the Assembly Food Hall. Visit DocLocalCo.com.